It is uh, Friday right now. Yesterday and the day before, uh, Wednesday. I can feel myself getting sick, getting that like, that little, little tinge right here in the throat and then like getting kind of like a sore left nostril. And I was getting just like a little bit slow and I was like, there's no way I'm getting sick. It's like every single expo I get freaking sick. Every expo, I mean, it's like, it's like clockwork. Friday now, um, I did cut out working out, so I haven't been working out for the last, I think, like, yesterday and today. I'm not going to work out, but the last two days, yesterday and today, I am going to do cardio. I'm doing about 15 minutes of stairs, just at, like, a low pace, and I've also lowered calories down to 27 to 2,800 calories because I'm not working out. I feel like I'm not burning that, so there's no need taking it in. So right now, I'm at the gym for the cardio session of the day. It's, like, the only thing I get to do. It's funny because normally you hate cardio, but like right now it's really exciting to do cardio because it's the only thing I get to do. But I have a surprise for you guys. JD Beard Gains is here. We got JD Beard Gains doing Stairmaster with yours truly. Oh man, I'm winded. So what are you weighing? What today, are you coming in at? Today I woke up at 150.0 on the dot. Damn, man. It's crazy the weight differences. I, uh, I bulked up to about 170. Uh huh. And I've been tapering my diet down since January 1st. And uh, Oh, you're doing, yeah, that's right. They don't know that. You're doing a competition before the competition with us. Yeah, it'll be my first one. I kind of want to just get a feel for it so that when I do it with you guys, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready to go. I'm going to have a buddy behind the scenes that knows what he's doing besides Brian. It's going to be sweet. Stairs suck. Stairs suck. Actually, stairs aren't too bad. I mean, it's better than running. Running makes me sore for three days. Did you know that? If I run, I'll be sore for three to four days. No joke. Really? Yeah. <sighs> yeah. <clears throat> All right, so I just got home from the gym and something came in the mail for me just now. I'm pretty sure I know what it is. Opening, opening. I am having a lot of trouble opening this. That must mean that I'm definitely, definitely sick. Okay. Protein box. Uh, these guys contacted me on Instagram, wanted to send me some, and I was like, absolutely, because I'm starting my cut soon, so I'm gonna need really good stuff that's low in calories. Perky jerky. I've never, uh, I've never ever tried this in my life. Wow, 120, 120 calories for this this whole thing? That is not bad. I actually like am now craving like sweets and other stuff. So stuff like this is gonna come in really handy. We got some Crave pork jerky, which I've never heard of either. Black cherry barbecue. I'm, I'm doing, I don't even care. Oh man. That's oh, very good. Nut whey. We've also got bite fuel. Whoa, what is this thing? Grass fed beef, beef jerky, berries and nuts. So this is beef, whoa. This is like, this is like gourmet, oh really delicious looking beef jerky right here. Big shout out to Protein Box, and I'll post a link somewhere probably right down there if you guys wanna find this. I'm probably gonna go take a nap right now. All right, you guys, it is uh, Saturday night. I am still definitely sick, but I wanted to bring you guys along for making pho with baby girl. I should have like recorded this whole process, but I'm just super tired and sick. and I just wasn't in the mood. She made pho, like the full nine yards pho. Like we, we like burnt these onions that you're supposed to burn and you're supposed to put the burnt onion in here. What, what's the full story? I have a friend who's Vietnamese who I made friends with recently and she took me to the store, the Vietnamese store that she goes to, um, to buy all of this stuff um, and to show me how to make authentic pho. And then she told me the directions and so that's what I followed today. Just what she told me to do. I think this is more elaborate than the restaurants we normally go to, like me and Brian. <laughs> and JD Beard Gains was lucky enough to come over and uh, sample some of this. Can't wait. Oof. You're so excited. These are both, your guys are both like picture perfect. <clears throat> <clears throat> so uh, it is Sunday right now. It's like 11.30 in the, well, 11.30 in the afternoon, not morning. And this is going to be my first workout. I'm a little scared. I felt like the congestion stuff went away, but then it just came back within the last like 45 minutes or so. But I'm not like bone tired. My body isn't all sore and sick. 
it's just congestion, that's it. So I'm gonna try and do like a moderate workout right now and then see how I feel after. So that went well. Uh, I, it's weird after, cut, like I, so I haven't lifted since I've started cutting. I've been sick the entire time cutting, so it's kind of weird going back to the gym out of nowhere. Like it's kind of hard to gauge how that workout was because I'm still like fighting off the sickness a little bit at the very tail end here. But I've switched everything to like lean foods that aren't like super trashy. So it's like a whole different workout. I do have to say like just now, like I feel like I had a way better like mind muscle connection. It was like, there was no like interference between my brain and my muscles. It's kind of like, I don't know, it's kind of hard to explain. I feel like my central nervous system is firing faster because there's better food in my body. Oh, two people oh, you guys have not seen oh, for a exactly. very, very long time. Forando <laughs> Coloso. We're gonna do, we're gonna do uh, posing practice after the workout, which is something that, you looking forward to posing practice? Are you? No, Honestly? Not, not I'm not looking forward to posing practice in the slightest bit at all. I really don't feel like sitting there watching myself pose and well, you're gonna watch me. <laughs> fat. and watching other people pose, males. I'm, little, I'm excited about that one. Yeah, it's not gonna be that fun. Big fat, huge, giant fat reality check. <laughs> reality check for us just now, practicing this posing. I have to say, I don't know about you guys, but this just got very real for me. You competed before, so you know. Yeah, twice. I just did posing, and I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I nah. have to stand on stage pretty soon. No, nah, man. Uh, it's harder uh, than it looks, man. It really is. It's, it's way, way harder than it looks. It's way harder than it looks. It'll be fun, though. I guarantee it. I guarantee it'll be fun, man. You go up there, people are screaming, You're the lead! But then again, think about it. This is our first time ever doing it. If we practice yes. it six more times, we're going to... Well, be easy. and I I'm, know I'm gonna be watching more videos. On this. I'm realizing that I need to uh, roll out the sides yeah. of my back, Loose like my sure. like my erector spinae and stuff like that. The bottom of my back. I keep trying to twist and torque sideways to show off like, the side and everything, but my back just completely cramps up. And then the other thing that I'm I'm missing out on is so, like, like flexing the opposing arm. That's not that's not like doing something. It's it's pretty hard. It is literally Wednesday right now the day that you guys are actually watching this and I'm just finishing editing this video but I totally just realized that I completely did not update you guys on any of my stats. This week I'm coming in at 200.8 pounds. That's a that's almost a five pound drop from the very end of the bulk but that is completely fine baby girl. There's no reason to panic because in the beginning of these preps there's a lot of weight fluctuation also, you need to keep in mind that I was intaking a ton of sodium, so that means that my body was retaining a lot of water, and maybe more of that weight was water than I'd like to think, than muscle. So right now, at this instant, today, I'm at 3,000 calories a day. I'm doing about 15 minutes, actually I'm doing exactly 15 minutes of cardio a day. I'm extremely on point about that and very precise about it. And this time, I'm counting calories like you guys don't even know. This time I'm so on point with my calorie counting. I'm extremely proud of how on point I am and how precise I am with everything. I won't eat something unless I somehow count. During the sickness I dropped down to 2700 calories. I cut out lifting completely, but I was still doing the 15 minutes of cardio a day. So that is gonna be it for this one. I'm gonna be honest, I really, really wanna to get to the gym right now and then I wanna get packing for the Arnold because then I get to see you guys. I'm not sure of how many of you guys are going. Please comment below if you're coming because I wanna know who's coming. I will see you guys next time.